We're working tonight to find out if Anderson Community Schools will be closing again tomorrow. Yep, they were closed for a third straight day today with no option for e-learning because they say they just don't have enough teachers. The district is struggling to find a compromise with the teachers. The teachers say they want higher pay and lower insurance premiums. Yeah, our Gina Glero spoke to a parent today whose child is caught right in the middle of it all. This parking lot at Erskine Elementary School would normally be full of staff. Instead, it is empty. That's because around 100 teachers in the district have called off each day. This parent, who doesn't want to show her face, found out halfway through the day Tuesday her child's teacher wasn't at school. Another staffer was teaching the student because of lack of teachers. They're just like babysitters, you know, glorified babysitters. These students wasn't learning. They weren't teaching. Students learned online Friday because of staffing. Wednesday, the district closed altogether. Teachers are sending a message demanding lower insurance premiums. In response, the district proposes $2,000 more in pay and $10,000 in stipends over the next couple of years. The district, Anderson Federation of Teachers, and the state will meet on Thursday. Superintendent Dr. Joe Kronk says we are disappointed that these teachers are choosing to do this as it hurts our parents and students. We are appreciative of the vast majority of staff that have continued coming to work as we continue the bargaining process with the Anderson Federation of Teachers. As of now, the district does plan to hold school on Thursday, but it adds if it does have to cancel again, it will make parents and the public aware.